good morning to you, my friends. I'm Cork, and this is Core Keeper. And as you can see, a lot has changed since uh, the last time I played. First of all, the little dwarf man has moved in. He is now my permanent resident in my hotel underground. So he can be my merchant. See, all I needed was to make a bed. Uh, there's one thing that I have. Oh, hey, can I? I can regen health in the bed. There's one problem that I have with this game. It's just kind of a problem. It's not really a problem. But you see this, like every crafting station and every metal, every metal has its own crafting station. And every crafting station has a certain set of things that it can craft. So like if I want to craft stone base pieces, I go here. If I want to craft other base pieces, I go here. And if I want to craft different base pieces, I go here or here. So it's just the fact that if I want to craft something, I have to find which table it goes to. It's not a huge deal. It's just a minor thing. But anyways, I upgraded my house. I sorted my inventory. I got everything all beautiful and set up. So now I am ready to... Oh, there's a lot of slimes out there. I'm ready to move on and do some more mining. But before we do that, where's my map? Wanted to check out something. Um, do you remember that golden or the glowing box that we saw the other day? I didn't have my iron pickaxe when I saw that. And I'm wondering, can an iron pickaxe mine that particular material? Okay. Every time the big boss comes through here, all my torches get taken away. <laughs> and it gets really dark. So we're just going to mosey on over this way. Now, uh, let's just find out if we can dig these. We can! We can dig the grub walls. That's fantastic. Maybe, I think, hopefully. Okay, let's dig in there. Oh, 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 it still takes a long time. Larva hive wall. Not a fan. Hopefully these things don't explode into bugs. Okay, they just explode into goop. What's in this box? What is that? A tin axe? A slower but more damaging weapon against multiple enemies. <gasps> a new kind of weapon. What's this? Larva meat? Nope. Not a fan. And petrified egg. Fossilized eggshell. It feels light and brittle. Okay, great. Um, we're going to take the box because it looks kind of cool. A larva hive chest. Cool. Uh... Maybe we'll try the tin axe for a little bit. Let's, uh... Yeah, let's... It is slower, but... Probably hits like a truck. Cool! Okay, well, ah! That's fantastic. Let's, uh... Let's go back home now. Before the boss shows up. Let's test this axe out on this guy. Huh. Ooh. That's a lot of damage. I like the axe, that's pretty cool. Um, I wonder, can I upgrade it? I'm really curious because I want to. Tin bars! That's awesome! Okay, where did I put... Okay, I need to get reacquainted because I'm not quite familiar with where I put everything. Okay, this is my metals box. Right. Tin bars. And this stuff. That'll do. Oh, yes. This axe is going to be absolutely the best. Look at that. And now it does 129 melee damage. Great. Um, okay. And away goes this stuff. I'm gonna sort some things. And I got the new box. Great. I'm gonna eat some of the larva meat. That's probably delicious food, I'm sure. Okay. Now I think it's time to go get some more iron ore and explore the forgotten place a little bit better. Now that I can move around a little bit faster with an upgraded iron pickaxe. And try and get some more resources. It shouldn't take me too long. And hopefully we'll discover more about this place. Because right now it's just iron. There's nothing else there. I was hoping for like new enemies and stuff. And oh my goodness there's so many things on my bridge again. It's fine. I am able to maneuver. Outmaneuver them. And here we are. So I guess we'll go back to this big open place that we were at the other day. And see if anything's changed here. Maybe some people have moved in now that I've lit up the place. Huh. This place seems really uninhabited. 
Okay, well, I guess let's start digging. Oh, look at that. Two strikes and we get through the wall. Oh, it's a good day. Oh, it's a good day. Another room. Wow, lots of water. Oh, and this is the path, right? This is the path. This is the path that the big boy takes. I'm just gonna make a circling around point here. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Ooh, another rock carrot, or whatever it's called. Hello. Hello, guys. Oh, hello. You're not as welcome here. Ugh, two shot. Like a noob. Ooh, there's a path up there. Okay, let's, uh, let's get this thing. Yep. And I guess then we go up above. Quickly, 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 quickly. There we go, we're safe. Ooh, there's lots up here, and it's lit up for me. Okay. Oh my. Well, hello there. Oh, they're really quick. Oh, they're really quick. Ah, uh, I don't like it. I don't like it at all. Oh, they're so creepy in the dark. Hey, yay, yay, yay. I don't like. Okay, we're gonna have to take these guys real careful. I have no idea what they're up at. What? This, oh, there's so many of them. Ah. Uh, okay. We're gonna take this tactfully and carefully. And we're gonna go this way where there's none of them. Okay, there's one of them. Um, there's two of them. There's a big one. Ay, ay, ay. What am I supposed to do? I. Oh, he shoots a fire. He shoots a fire. Um, I'd like to fight one of you at a time here. Ah, oh. He, ha. Uh, oh, ha. Uh, oh, ha. Uh, oh, he's got lots of health. Okay, he's dead now. I got a cave pouch. Can I do anything with that? Um, but, but, but. Uh. Ooh. More inventory. Oh, yes, please. Well, that's like the backpack that I can't craft yet. There's so many of these guys. Oh, no. What am I gonna do? Ah! Big boss? Okay, the big boss went by. Okay, scared me a little bit. Gotta remember that I'm on the right side. Don't go down. I was just trying to see if I could see it. Oh, uh, no, no, I don't like this. Okay, we're gonna break through here. And then we're gonna fight this guy. Uh, huh. 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 Okay, we're doing just fine. We're doing just fine. We're doing just fine. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. We're doing just fine. Okay, there's a shaman stuck in there. That's good. Maybe we could. Oh boy, he, he saw me. He saw me. Uh, yeah. Huh. I don't know how much they hurt when they hit me. I'm hoping to not find out. Oh, they dropped fiber. That's good. Oh, okay. These guys seem slow. Eh, but also very strong. Hey, eh, hey. Oh, shooting fire. Shooting fire. Okay, I killed them. Okay, seems like they're very weak to melee damage. Hey, yep. Okay, I'm learning these guys. I'm learning them. Okay, this is great. I got caveling pants. Oh, hey, these are cavelings. Are those good? Plus 20 max health, plus dodge chance, mining speed. Um, they don't give any armor. Hmm. That's good for digging, though. Interesting. Oh, this place got a whole lot more creepy real quick. Oh, boy. Let's just break through over here. This is another part of the worm path. Some scrap? A whole bunch of... What happened here? Uh-oh. 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 Run, 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 run. I'm just confused as to what has happened here. I guess the, uh, the worm killed a whole bunch of guys here. Was it these guys? I guess it may have been. Interesting. Oh, oh, I missed. Okay, we're fine. I still haven't taken a hit from these guys. So I don't know if they're gonna one-shot me. What was that? It was a gear. Mechanical part. Those are important. 
Those are for use. Those are for making the locators for the bosses. Holy moly. Okay, he can shoot kind of through there. Ow! I'm running up. I'm dead? Okay, well, there we go. I now know how much damage they do. A lot is the answer. My armor is kind of blech. Can I reinforce it again? I need a lot of tin to upgrade this. Oh boy. Maybe I should just stick for making iron armor for now. Just try and not get hit anymore. Okay, ouch. Those guys hit hard. Luckily I didn't lose too much of my stuff. I lost the iron, which I should have been keeping in my hotbar. I keep forgetting that that's the mechanic of this game. Let's grab up this wood while I'm here. Well, that was exciting. Um, so to you guys, it looked like nothing happened, but actually it's, um, almost six o'clock in the afternoon right now. When I started around nine, I started recording around nine or 10 and it's six o'clock. I'll tell you what, um, power went out and it just came back a few minutes ago and I was desperately, I was, I was, <laughs> I was under a lot of stress because I thought that the first half of this recording was gone and that all this fun stuff that I had seen would be completely taken away from me. But I'll tell you what, I was praying and my prayers were answered. Yes and- oh, hello. My prayers were answered and my recordings was- it was saved. My audio and my gameplay recording was saved so I have to thank my heavenly father above for blessing me that way. Whew, that's a huge weight off of my mind. So we can pick up right where we left off. That's fantastic. So uh, these guys one shot me. <laughs> so I'm gonna not let them do that. Uh, oh, we've got two up two. Okay, you know what I, that thing I said about not letting them do it. Oh, hey, I'm, I'm in my bed. All my armor is gone. <laughs> so um, I'll tell you what guys. I'm gonna take my armor off. It's not doing me any good in the Forgotten Temple. Not one tiny bit of good. So uh, we're gonna put you in here for now. Hopefully it will be retired soon and replaced with a fresh set of fine iron armor. That would be fantastic. Um, I will say I still am a little bit out of sorts, kind of not really remembering where I was because as I said, that was this morning and it was kind of a stressful situation. Uh, dealing with this whole thing. Um, so, bear with me if things are a little confused. Okay, got it back. Oh, there's eyes in the darkness. Please no. And I'm going to say, nah, we ain't doing this place right now. Nope, nope, nope. We're moving off. We're backing away slowly. Well, in my case, quickly. And we're just gonna get some armor and wait. That's not the right death stone, is it? Hold on, I didn't get anything from it. Where's all my stuff? Where's all my iron ore? Uh-oh, am I in trouble? That was the death I just had, but not the death I needed. Uh-oh, I think that's it. Uh, okay, we're making a brave expedition into here and grabbing this. Is that the one? Oh, that's the one, okay. We're good, we're good. No need to fear, I'm leaving. I am not fighting in this place anymore until my everything disconnects. What happened? Okay, everything is reconnected now. That was a lot of damage. I am so confused what's happening right now. My controller and audio just disconnected for a second and then it reconnected a second later. I'm... Today's been weird, guys. <laughs> Today's been a really weird day, and I'm about done with it. So please, just let me mine some iron in peace. Please and thank you. It's happening again? Okay, I don't know why things are freezing up. Maybe it's because my computer's been dead all day, and it's just waking up. Come on, boy. Wake up. You can do it. You can do it. You're a beast. Now we're hitting the big money. This is what I'm here for. Uh, so I want a full set of iron armor before I even dare set foot back in that place. I can't remember how much I have back at home. But I've got quite a bit now. Thing is, I need to make the anvil and the workstation. I think. 
Yeah, I don't think I made... No, I did make the workstation because I have the pickaxe. Okay, so I need to make the anvil, which is where I make the armor. So, hopefully, we can get enough to do that. Uh, I think I'm just going to head home with this. This stack of 40. Okay, where exactly am I? I could just cut over, and I think I will. We'll just dig on over there. Hopefully there's enough real estate to walk across. Yeah, I think this is good enough. That's a huge gold vein. Also rays of sunlight, which I've seen a couple times before. Oh, oh it's a box of greens. That's kind of nice. It's such a lush little cave. That's a place to mark for later because I cannot hold any of that stuff. So I'm going to keep on going home and remember this area. Okay, the nightmare is over. I have my stuff. Everything is good. Start smelting some iron and I need to organize my inventory. Okay, so I've got the iron work table here. I need the iron anvil, which is 10 iron bars. I've got seven. And I should have enough to at least make that now. So we can make iron armor and an iron bow. That seems kind of cool. So it's 10, 15, and 13. And a lot of fiber. Oh no. Oh no, oh no. Well, looks like I need fiber, guys. I've actually probably got enough uh, iron, which is kind of cool. But I don't have anywhere near enough fiber. Which is something I uh, probably should start working on, honestly. Hmm. Well, tell you what. Uh, seeing as how this episode is kind of already half recorded for me, I'm going to end this right now. And I think we've got enough footage for this episode. And I guess maybe next time we'll try and figure out how to get fiber. I'm pretty sure it's from farming, so maybe we'll make an iron e uh, uh, hoe and make a little farm maybe over there. Extend my base a little bit and start farming. Might be a good idea. But anyways, that'll be for next time. And until then, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this episode of Core Keeper. If you did, leave a like. And if you haven't already and you would like to, subscribe to see more Core Keeper and all the other things I post right here on this channel. And as always, guys, in case you don't see you, good afternoon, good evening, and good night.